it makes a lot of us really happy and feel good about ourselves. I'm Rachel Sanders, and thanks for watching Go Gwinnett. So I'm here at the Gwinnett County Jail as we learn about the Fresh Start Garden program that helps the female population grow in unique ways. Well, here you have the Gwinnett County Jail's Fresh Start Garden. It was built back in 2016 uh, for the female inmates. This program provides nonviolent inmates with hands-on experience in all aspects of vegetable cultivation. From preparing soil, sowing seeds, nurturing the plants, to harvesting the bountiful produce, every step brings a sense of accomplishment and pride. And Deputy James Wilson is the program's biggest supporter. And we realized, wow, this is a big opportunity for therapy. So it became a female's fresh start garden where they come, they, they learn self-sustainability, uh, the best practices for um, organic gardening. It's therapeutic and it helps them uh, deal with a lot of trauma and the stress that they have every day. Ashley Strickland and her fellow residents have daily access to large garden beds with a variety of herbs and vegetables. It means a lot to me. I, I love it. It's great for your mental, your mental health. It brings all the girls together here. And these women are not just growing as gardeners. They are planting the seeds of responsibility, teamwork, and personal development. I enjoy it because it teaches me how to plant things, um, start over in life, which is like a seed. You know, you plant it and then you get to watch it grow. And the success of you growing a plant, but not just growing a plant, growing as a person with the plant. At the root is Gwinnett deputies pulling double duties as master gardeners and mentors. And I also want to thank Ms. Perez for letting me be a part of the root program. Deputy Wild Perez understands the importance of providing each inmate with passion, understanding, and a positive environment. They take pride in the garden. In order to understand what type of help they need, we have to talk to them. We have to find out where they're coming from and what their goal is. Uh, once they get released, we either send them to the rehab that we, um, we find for them. We help them find jobs by connecting them with the right resources in the county. And speaking of connecting, and when the harvest is ready, they come right here to the Southeast Gwinnett Co-op. Here in the pantry is where we distribute and receive food items, um, both packaged items as well as fresh produce for our clients. That's LaShawn Alford. She's the pantry manager at the Southeast Gwinnett Co-op. We are lucky and blessed to also have a partnership with Gwinnett County Jail that comes and brings us fresh produce from the jail. It's one of my favorite things. Um, actually, we got into that relationship with Deputy Wilson. He came one day just with some random produce, and from there we have grown and getting more and more produce from them. On average, the jail's Fresh Start Garden program donates hundreds of pounds of fresh produce weekly. And we thank uh, Gwinnett County Jail for partnering with us as well to make sure we get those fresh vegetables and uh, other produce for our families. Supporting programs such as Gwinnett County Jail's Fresh Start Garden and their partnership with local co-ops can create a foundation for a brighter future for those in need. This place doesn't define who you are. This is just a stepping stone in your next uh, stage of your life. From the jail to the co-op, it's all about helping Gwinnett County Jail residents grow and Gwinnett County residents thrive. I'm Rachel Sanders, and thanks for watching.